Hello and welcome to my Great British Bake Off build. The Bake Off is back, it started last Tuesday, it was great even though it's now on channel 4, it was still amazing, Noel Fielding and Sandy Tubbs were really great even though their chemistry is not that great at the moment, but as they were like individual persons, people as I should say, they, they were really funny their chemistry together is a little bit of work. I like the new Judge Prue. I think she'll come a bit more into her element as the series goes on. So I have, we just got to the inside of the build and I've been using the counters from Parenthood. I did want to use the green ones but I wanted to have the matching worktops like, because all the Great British Break Off surfaces are all matching and they're all bright colours so I kind of wanted to reflect that in the build. And I do realise later on that it's obviously too small, so I extend all the benches so they're four wide so your sims have lots of room to make a lot of mess and create their amazing bakes. The bakes last week were amazing. I loved the illusion cakes. They were so good, especially the watermelon cake and the champagne cake. That was amazing. And yeah, I haven't really got a favourite contestant at the moment because it's a bit too early in the series but I think Jo who made the watermelon cake she was amazing I think she would be one of the key like characters in this series so I'm just I'm trying to add a load of decoration like 10 tea decoration because they like fill up with all baking stuff but I don't really have that much baking stuff so it's kind of trying to find items that I could use that sort of represented sort of like the mixers I use coffee machines and trying to fill it with as much as possible. Lots of plants, they have loads of plants around because it's in the middle of the countryside. And so for the roof I used two of the square roofs and sort of made them into little peaks and then used the normal one and then covered it in the, the plain white. And then I thought I'd add some of the studio lighting to sort of because it is basically an outdoor studio but it was getting a bit too green and red and blue because they're the colours of the studio lights so I sort of added the big beam of lights and this is what it looks like from the outside so you've got your own little bake-off tent so you can make your own little creations and you've got Paul and Mary wandering around with my sim making their cakes reading up on their things that's what the inside looks like I've sort of raised up the ovens because you can't there's no built-in ovens in the sims 4 at the moment but you can't actually use the ovens so if you want to use this you'll have to like place it on the floor like the one at the front so you can actually bake your cakes in yeah spinning round give it a good look so these sim screenshots Paul looks very hungry in that shot and he's like, where is my cake? Where is it? As so the shot from the back, looking down the tent. And from the side, give you a close up of what the de sort of desk looks like. <laughs> and like, Paul, here's my cake. Paul's sniffing it. What's he going to think? Mm, yes. Ah, oh, yes. A bit in full, oh, but oh, it was okay. very moist. Thank you, Paul. <laughs> so if you enjoyed that, thank you for watching. Give us a like subscribe and tune in for the next one. Bye!